Hey, what's going on YouTube? I am back with another story time. And you know, if you do like these story times, please like, subscribe, ring that bell. And now on to the time my brother and his friend got me extremely sick on booze. Uh, it was, I was probably like, what was I had to have been maybe 15 16 uh, the timeline's a little blurry exactly when but definitely in that that teenage age i had drinking a good handful of times before hell technically the first time i drank i was 10 but uh, my brother and i we did not have too many drunken moments together at this point maybe a couple but in a very different social circumstance and basically my brother and his buddy uh, wanted to get me like drunk, like sick off of booze for what you know, just to kind of be dicks about it. Not that I, I mean, I should have been totally aware of it, but I, I learned my lesson and not going to do that again. Uh, so they went ahead and it was like basically my brother i think he was home for the co from college for you know for a little bit of time off a of break and he was you know visiting old friends and whatnot and these are people that i also had you know been acquaintances of and knew of basically i was i was that dude's little brother oh man and so we went out and i was just gonna like hang out with him for the evening and we ended up getting some booze it was uh they got some weird honey wheat beer or something which should have been red flag number one i mean they something that is like never drink they're just like hey i just got some honey wheat beer stuff and then some um is it johnny walker johnny i think it was johnny walker actually yeah uh, i'm not 100 percent sure the details of that are a little blurry because uh, all it really took was one shot but basically what ended up happening is we we went and we hung out at some other buddy's spot who was like they had their own house at that time and whatnot and they had this like decent big screen with uh with with halo and whatnot so basically just like i don't know we were hanging out and chilling there for a bit and I was on a playing Halo 3 at the time, just sipping down these these honey wheat beers. Little did I notice they really weren't drinking them. It was mostly me. And I that should have been also apparent, but for whatever reason in my head, I'm like, oh, okay, whatever. So I drink down about three of these. I'm mean, gonna get that rich, you know, when something's a little rich and you get that feeling in your throat. That's kind of where I was getting already with this like honey wheat beer. It was just like, I didn't have any water in between drinking beers. I didn't, I just kind of kept drinking these, these honey wheat beers for whatever reason. And then they, they, uh, as I'm playing Halo, they, they call me over to the kitchen and they're like, Hey, take a shot with us. Take a shot with us. Come on, come on. They were like coaxing me into it. I was like already kind of feeling Ew, from the, from the beer. So I was like kind of already saying, but they, for whatever reason convinced me to take that one shot and i it just like took that shot uh and they were fine of course because they didn't really have those honey wheat beers uh, but i did and so within about like i don't know maybe like 20 minutes it just like that that liquor that was can just hit that beer in just the right way that foam started to build in my stomach and it was so just just that overwhelming just like rich feeling in my throat i ended up just running to the bathroom as as like it just it was like it just kind of hit me like i'm gonna throw up now i'm gonna throw up now and i feel just i just felt that like I was kind of like stumbling and just kind of like hard to follow a straight line, of course. <laughs> and it was it was definitely rough, but I immediately got there and I just like, oh, just projectiled into the toilet and then proceeded to spend like the rest of the night pretty much complete shit faced in the bathroom, just puking and then laying by there. And I literally that's why I slept that night is I literally just slept by the toilet, passed out. And it was just like, damn. So I wake up with that, of course, a freaking massive hangover. And this is the thing. It's like, if I had 
the liquor before drinking the beer, it wouldn't have been an issue. And they knew that. It was pretty clear they knew that. And uh, their their intentions were definitely devious. And it should have been apparent from the get-go. Um, that's why it's like... Yeah, just looking back, I should have just been... I should have just known from the, from the start. But uh, we wake up. I'm super hungover. They're a little bit hungover. They definitely, of course, had the freaking nice bottle of liquor uh, without me but they definitely woke up with a hangover too we ended up going to the local taco star got our carne asada burrito you know carne asada guacamole pretty solid hangover food got you know I got myself a horchata with it and it was a it was a pretty nice little feeling gross the following day for pretty much the entire day but it was it was an interesting experience and uh something i should have been uh eyeing it on from the get-go because it, it, I, I think it was just kind of like the first tester because we like i said we didn't really drink that much together or whatnot it wasn't really it, w it was one of the beginning times of us drinking together uh, it, it just yeah i think it, i think you just want to do it is to be like this is what a nasty hit this is what booze will do to you <laughs> this is a nasty hangover we're gonna give it to you kind of thing i don't know some big brother shit but uh yeah i ended up you know having to take the whole day like just recovering hangover wise and then i yeah was pretty much fine but uh we ended up have gotten into a lot more drunken debauchery uh <laughs> after that for you know a long while but in any case that was the time my brother got me super shit face sick off of booze if you do enjoy this content again please like subscribe ring that bell you have a great rest of your day